Okay, Samantha, this is Kurshid from Uncle K Live TV. I'm known as Uncle K. Hello, Uncle oh, K. Hi. So, this was surprising. I, I stopped and thought twice before asking you the question that whether maybe you will make fun of me that I don't know what's the difference between a desert salt and a sea salt. So, one, maybe most of the viewers there are also like me, they are confused. So, could you explain to them? Absolutely. Thank you. So, yes, this is a unique product in that it is desert salt and not sea salt. So, in South Africa, the Kalahari Desert is two and a half million square kilometers, and there's a 50 square kilometer salt pan. What they discovered underground is a brine lake with 55 million tons of brine. And it's fed by underground rivers, 30 to 100 meters. And it flows over rock strata that are 300 million years old. So the source of the salt is absolutely pure and pristine and unpolluted and beautiful. It's got a beautiful taste profile when you compare it to sea salt. And the salt pan is 750 kilometers from the ocean. So it's got absolutely nothing to do with the sea. Okay, uh, Samantha, sorry if I interrupt you because Absolutely. this question I'll forget. Mm -hmm. uh, mostly like rock salt, you know, mm. they have it in these, uh, you have these grinders here. Mm. So are these also in short crystals or just powdered variety? No, so rock salt is actually a solidified lake. Our lake is running and we pump it up, we sun dried it, crystallizes in four weeks. So we put it through a sieve to get a coarse salt to put into the grinder. We crush it for medium and we crush it for four fine. So the chefs like to use the fine and the, and the medium. And then the coarse is good for the grinding and also for curing fish and so on. No, it's, uh, the crystals are big enough to put in a grinder? Absolutely. It's two to four millimeters, the okay, crystals. It's not like the other uh, sea salt, which is just powdery. No, no. The sea salt all crystallizes, but then they crush it. And they refine so it and they crystallize I didn't know yes. that technical part. Yes, yes. Okay. So our salt, we add no chemicals and preservatives or additives. And we don't take any of the important 75 minerals and trace elements that the body needs together with the sodium chloride. And it's got a much, it's got a very gentle flavor, the salt. Come okay. A question which is closer to my heart, which I need, is what about blood pressure people? Well, this salt has a 30% lower sodium. And because it's got a full flavor, you use less. So every time you're using less salt with less sodium. So it's, and it's very, very good for your body. All right, Samantha. Thank, thank you thank very you much too. for the day. It was really, I'm learning at my old age. I'm still learning. Absolutely. Things. I'd love to also share that the, the Kalahari Desert and this region are the only regions that have the oryx, which are indigenous okay. um, to the two regions. And they can go up to two years without drinking water but not two months without licking salt that's how important it is thank you for sharing <laughs> that thing because i've seen you know uh, in farms in my country they put these salts around and i asked them why they said these are for the goats okay. and all yes, that means they need important. salt they, they need, salt. need salt so we would love to get our products into retail and also into the restaurants i'm mean, into food service because the chefs okay. love our salt sure so any distributor who wants can contact them directly because the at the end of the video you'll see their contacts. Fantastic. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Lovely to meet you. Bye. Bye.